Explain to us the intra-animal thing of this virus we have right now. Absolutely. Well, viruses are really adapted to infect a particular kind of species. So we have human viruses, we have cat viruses, we have monkey viruses, and the virus sort of comes to an agreement with its animal host and uh, usually doesn't want to kill its host because it wants to thrive and pass on um, things, uh, the viruses to other species of the same species. However, uh, the problem is that when a virus jumps from an animal to a human, it's suddenly in this strange new environment and anything could happen. And, and usually the biggest outbreaks and disease, diseases we have right. are in that situation. Dr. When Rohn, something jumps from an animal to a human. Yeah, back to David Baltimore a few years ago and you know, just the idea of how viruses mutate. Are we dealing with a stable illness or do you just presume over the weeks, over the months, this virus can mutate into forms either good or bad? That's a good point. It's a, it's, the virus is made out of RNA, not DNA, and that makes it inherently a little bit less stable than other viruses. Uh, so it definitely could mutate. And in fact, when viruses jump to animals, that's sometimes one of the first things that it does. It shuffles around to try to get its bearings, and it changes. So yes, it might be slightly less stable than other viruses, but uh, early indications is, are that it's a bit more stable than something like influenza. 